friends, this is Vali with Vali Art and I'm here today to share with you another one of my spreads from my uh, Just Because journal. So I wanted to show you that I have been working in the covers. Um, so I think I showed you in another video uh, this cover um, with this embellishment here and it's fabric. And then um, I used for the back, and this is a page of <laughs> made of a cereal box um i used wrapping paper from um the dollar store and then in the back i added this sticker uh, that came with uh, with their um happy planner collection from the dollar store and i thought it was um appropriate for um the journal what it says it's uh, what is done in love is done well and that's from Vincent van Gogh so then um, this is if this is gonna allow me to flip the page there um, so um, this is from uh, my backyardigan section and I decided to uh, paint the cardinals that live in my backyard this particular couple has been here for years and they have babies every summer. I'm gonna add the picture of uh, the baby that they just had. Uh, so I'm following uh, the progress um, and they have it inside of my uh, blackberry tree. And I'm always happy when uh, they put their nest in my backyard because I feel privileged that they chose me uh, to come and um, form their family uh, in my house. So basically what I did with this uh, spread was very, very simple. The bag the, is constructed in um, a cereal box and then I covered that cereal box with um, this backdrop here and this is uh, from um, a children's book I think it's from Julie Andrews if I'm not wrong um, so um, I decided to cut that backdrop and use it for this page um, I liked it because it has that pale pink and then uh, the birds would um, pop out. So uh, what I did is I painted the birds in watercolor paper um, and then I cut them out and joined them in here. So I even uh, painted them on a branch um, so that they would be um, staying somewhere within the spread. So the birds were very simple to paint and they may look dif uh, difficult, but they are not. Uh, very, very simple. And I used uh, watercolors, um, the Crayola watercolors. So nothing expensive there. And still, um, I think it acquired a good um, result. So then I decided to just go ahead um, and um, add a title to the page. Um, all things bright and beautiful uh, that's a title also from that I had cut out from a children's book I think it may be the same book as um, the backdrop I always um, check the magazines that I receive the books um, and I always take um, a little bit and cut out um, different titles that I think I may be able to use and I put them in an envelope. So sometimes when I want to add a title, I just go to that envelope and for sure I'm gonna find something that is gonna match whatever I need. So then on the sides and very, very tiny, um, I used some uh, washi tapes uh, from the dollar store and it has like some um, green branches and then um, I added some little hearts uh, to embellish um, the page and uh, they are like iridescent and um, I um, those little hearts are uh, from the dollar store too and they are embellishment for nails but I use them in uh, my journals 
and finally i wanted to add some other insects in here so they have some um, ladybugs and that's from also the dollar store from a booklet of uh, their insect collection uh, probably you can see too that this is the male cardinal and this is the, the female so they both have like some um, shining here and uh, in the beak and the feathers and he does too and that is done with a glitter marker red um, also from the dollar store and then I did my journaling portion uh, it was done with Indian ink and my calligraphy pen and it says of all the birds that visit my backyard the cardinals are my favorite for years a couple has made my home theirs and I could not be happier the other day I discovered that they had decided to build their nest on a pine by my kitchen window after all these years I call them my friends so this is the story um, the, the nest that they built in the pine um, a storm came and blew it away and that made me super sad for a couple of days i couldn't see the eggs anywhere i looked for them i was hoping that probably they saved them um, but i couldn't find them so later like a month after that i discovered another nest with um, more babies in the um, blackberry tree so um, I will leave the pictures at the very end and a short video of the baby. I hope you enjoy it and I hope this um, inspires you to um, share with others um, the beauty that um, you have at hand. Uh, at least that's what I try to do with um, my art and these videos. So I hope you have a wonderful week and we will see each other in the next video. Bye.